backpacks in the front hall. Papers piled up in the kitchen. Back to school can mean a big mess for a lot of families. And of course, this is just the beginning of the year, so it's only going to pile up. But it doesn't have to be that way. The Valley Today's Christy Larson has been talking all morning with one of our favorites, Miss Simplicity, helping us all get a little organized for back to school. Hi, Christy. Good morning, guys. Yeah, we showed you this morning that you can easily put things like kids' pencils and markers inside of these jars, but I think one of the biggest things is what helps them stay even more organized is even doing and keeping up with the chores. So you have some ways to do that, too. Well, I think it's more about sanity for the parents because it really is a household of people that all have to work together because it's not fun or fair if just one person does everything. So try to have systems that are fun and easy to maintain. I've seen elaborate chore systems and elaborate systems that are created in lots of money. Like there are big box stores that sell beautiful chore systems and then it's abandoned a week later. Right. So let's do something simple. So this is just taking some craft sticks and writing the chores on a stick, putting it in a jar, and then say, okay, everybody's got to come do a chore, pick it out. And mom and dad need to do one too, so yep. they can they can pull it out. And Jesse, the cameraman, was so funny. He's like, just have mow be on every <laughs> stick. Mow that lawn. Yeah, mow that Otherwise, lawn. you could write it on fun paper, like paint samples. Yeah, so I, I saw this on Pinterest, this idea, is just get paint um, little swatches and write it on there for the kids too because then these are disposable and they're brightly colored and it, you can change it up so this is just a morning routine one I did so what do you want your kids to do in the morning very easy get dressed make the bed eat breakfast and brush their teeth and be right. ready to go right um, this is another idea is put a, a, a we all are a little motivated by monetary um, item so just put a chore with a little dollar incentive and then just put it on the fridge might be the perfect way to get kids finally to get out those dusting items or maybe the vacuum. And again, we have the links up on valleynewslive.com where you can watch more on how to get some of those papers and supplies organized this school year. I like that idea. Stick some money in there, you might get your house vacuumed. Who knew? Fingers crossed. <laughs> Fingers crossed. <laughs> Thank you, Christy.